Welcome to Crafty Chemist Designs. Today I will be going over the brand new Close to My Heart July, August, September catalog. We have moved to a three month catalog cycle. I'm so excited about this. Let's take a look inside. First, it tells you all about how to become a maker or how to become a VIP. If you would like more information, check out my website. Close to My Heart does have a scrapbooking subscription program called Craft with Heart. You can choose between 4-month and 12-month subscriptions and get regular deliveries of our exclusive Cut Above Layout kits. We also have a Craft with Heart card making subscription program where you can get cards delivered to you. The first collection in the catalog is called Beach Party and what a fun collection this is. The colors are Candy Apple, Bluebird, Sapphire, Capri, Clover, Shortbread, Nectarine, Mocha, and White Daisy. Let's take a look at the papers. The Beach Party paper packet and sticker sheet comes with six sheets, two each of the three double-sided designs. And you can get it with or without the sticker sheet that I'm showing right now. This sticker sheet is gorgeous and you can see that um, there is a UV coating on some of the stickers that make it shine. I love the little bus and the surfboard. I have some samples to show you close up. These are the six designs and they are so much fun together. This one is a blue wave pattern and this is a, sort of a sun dance and a hat, hatched marks. This one is filled with beach balls of different colors. How fun. And this has um, little stripes that are candy apple. This is a really fun paper. It's like at the pole. There's people laying on the floats. There's little islands. And this one is a collage of uh, beach blankets and umbrellas. So cute. You can get the curated set of Beach Party Coordinating Cardstock. You get 12 sheets, two each of White Daisy, Sundance, Clover, Capri, Bluebird, and Candy Apple. And here you go. I'm showing the light and dark side of each color sheet. And it's such a classic summer look. Almost all the colors of the rainbow. The special elements for the Beach Party collection are these Beach Party rubber shapes. And they're very unique. I haven't seen something like this, really. They are, they're not puffy stickers. They're kind of like puffy stickers, but they're not puffy. These are rubbery. So they remind me of those little rubber erasers that you used to be able to buy with are like different shapes and you can see them here they're not very thick I mean they're they're I would say the, the thickness of a puffy sticker we have a beach party digital art collection um, that you can cut a variety of shapes that coordinate with the paper collection it's got um, two built-in card designs I love the watermelon we also have the Beach Party Picture My Life cards. Here you get 24 double-sided pocket cards featuring unique designs. Let's look at the Beach Party card making stamp set. You can get this either with or without thin cuts. Such cute designs. And then we have the Beach Party scrapbooking stamps. You can get this with or without thin cuts. I love the beach blanket and the little pop bottle is so cute and the flip-flops and some really nice sentiments so these are great for scrapbooking pages We've got nice large sentiments sunshine time to relax beach time keeping cool in the pool i love the glasses and the um, flip-flops i purchased the set with the thin cuts so i don't have to fussy cut all those images out this is a scrapbooking workshop kit. You get all of the materials you need to create three 12 by 12 two page layouts. 
And in the kit, you get all of those products. You get one beach party paper pack and sticker sheet, five card stocks, one bluebird, three capri, one sundance, three exclusive pattern paper sheets that are 12 by 12, three exclusive die cut sheets, one beach party rubber shapes, and the memory protectors. We also have a card making workshop. This is such a cute set. Look at that little um, VW bug. In this set, it contains all of the materials you need to make 16 cards for each of those four designs that I showed you. You get the B-size stamp set, the papers, card socks, and silver um, loose sequins. And you get the 12 white cards and envelopes. So here I made a sample using the beach party papers and um, sticker sheet. The second collection in this catalog is called Backyard Bliss, and this is such a beautiful collection. It is somewhat garden themed, and look at all of the colors that um, are found in this set. Candy apple, papaya, sapphire, rosemary, sage, pine, new color, shortbread, nectarine, mocha, toffee, mink, linen, pewter, and white daisy. I love the little... Um, Wellington boots there. Let's take a close-up look at the papers. You can get the papers with or without the sticker sheet that's shown there. You get six, six sheets, two each of three double-sided designs, and then the you can choose the sticker sheet or not. Look at this sticker sheet. I love all of the beautiful gardening designs. I love the sentiment there. And even the little chickens, how cute. The water uh, pail with the flowers in it. Let's take a close-up look of all of the papers. There are the six sheets. And aren't they beautiful? It's like a very muted um, design. Uh, this one is uh, has sort of, I don't know, it looks like a leaf design on it. This one is uh, grass, all over grass. This one is really cute. It's like a gray background, and it's got white chicken wire design on it. Definitely need to use that with the chicken stickers. This is a really nice paper. It's uh, like wood planks, and you can see the little um, nail, nail holes in it. And I love this all over floral. I could see so many uses for that. And then the last page is really the only page that I would call garden themed. This is the one that has the you know watering can. It has some vegetables in it. But um, if you don't want to use the gardening design, you can just use the reverse side that has the more generic flowers. Okay, the coordinating cardstock with this, you get 12 sheets, two each of white daisy, shortbread, papaya, sage, pine, and a sapphire. This collection is a nice muted color. I'm glad to see we're going back to some of these, these color schemes instead of being really bright. This is a nice, soft, calming uh, collection. This one does include the new pine color. Let me show you what it looks like here. So this is a sneak peek of a new color from the new core catalog that will start in um, August. The elements for this collection are uh, die cuts. They're on a um, sort of a craft color uh, paper it's thicker than cardstock but it's not um, as thick as um, you know big paperboard or chipboard it's um, it's thick enough but not too thick some nice uh, sentiments and uh, flowers and pennants we do have a digital art collection 
that has um, three different scrapbook layouts that are pre-created for you. You just have to hit make and uh, put the different papers in. I love the one that has that uh, sort of lace overlay. And look at all of the cute vegetables that you can get to cut out. Even a couple birds and the chickens. And there's the Backyard Bliss Picture My Life cards. You get 24 double-sided pocket cards featuring the unique designs. This is the Backyard Bliss card making stamp and it's so different and unique. I really love the um, like fields there. And then we have the Backyard Bliss scrapbooking stamp set. This one is very garden centered. It's got the vegetables, the seed packets, and look at the cute layout that they made with that. So cute. This is the scrapbooking workshop kit for the Backyard Bliss. You can make these three two page layouts with all of the materials that come in your kit. You get everything you need. You get one Backyard Bliss paper pack and sticker sheet, six cardstock sheets, two papaya, two pine, two white daisy, three exclusive pattern paper sheets, three exclusive die cut sheets, one Backyard Bliss die cuts, and the memory protectors if you choose. I do have this collection. I haven't put it together yet, but I'll show you all of the things that you get with it. And look at this cute overlay. That's a heart. And the heart, is, it's like a wooden, uh, has a wooden design on it. It's just a print. And then the backside are all of the different colored um, hearts that you can use inside. And there's the, there's what it looks like on the page really fun and then you have the overlay with the circles this is the exclusive paper I love that paper look at that those flowers across the bottom so beautiful okay let's take a look at the backyard bliss card making workshop kit Use the materials in this kit to create 16 cards for each of the four designs. You do get this exclusive B-size stamp set plus the coordinating thin cuts, two Backyard Bliss pattern paper sheets, six cardstock sheets, one papaya, one pine, one sapphire, one shortbread, and two white daisy. You get a roll of silver shimmer trim plus the 16 um, card bases and envelopes. The special thing about these um, stamps and die cuts is there's a little slit that's cut in there that you can slide the um, flowers in to look like it's inside. This is the third collection in the catalog and it is called Crisp Air. This is for um, September, so we're starting to get into the fall. I love the color scheme of this one. It's peach, sapphire, pine, Sundance, Nectarine, Paprika, Mocha, Toffee, and White Daisy. Look at the cute cards there. And the papers are just out of sight. They're amazing. So the Crisp Air Paper Pack, you can get it either with or without the sticker sheet. You get six sheets, two each of three double-sided designs. And you can choose to get the sticker sheet. Look how beautiful it is. I want you to pay particular attention to these leaves. They're like watercolored with different um, colored designs, like they're turning, right? You got a little bit of green, but you also have some of the oranges and reds and yellows. It's really amazing. Let's take a close up look of these. Here are the six designs. Look at the pumpkins. The pumpkins are also sort of watercolored on the page. This one is an overall background of all of those leaves. And again, they are watercolor perfection. This paper is absolutely amazing. Uh, there are so many uses for this. You can use it as is. You can cut out the squares of so many possibilities. This is a blue design with some uh, leaves on the background. 
This paper is so cute. It's white background and then it has like water colored splotches of all of those um, fall sort of colors. And then the last one is this, um, I would say paprika background uh, plaid paper. You can choose to get the Crisp Air Coordinating Cardstock. The colors have been curated for you by Close to My Heart. You get 12 sheets. And in this one, you get three of each of these, pine, paprika, toffee, and mocha. Look at that color scheme. So beautiful for fall. I can almost smell the leaves. The elements for this uh, collection are crisp air dots. You get 112 adhesive backed enamel dots and paprika, peach, pine, sapphire, sundance, and toffee glitter. They range from 4 millimeter to 8 millimeter. We do have the crisp air digital art collection and there is a built in scrapbook page. I love that vine and some pumpkins. We also have the Crisp Air Picture My Life cards. You get 24 double-sided pocket cards. You get 12 of 4 by 6 cards and 12 3 by 4 cards. The Crisp Air card making stamp set is um, going to be a hot item. I recommend you don't wait until September to buy this. You should buy this early on because it's going to be a bestseller. And what's special about these is there's these different oval designs and you put three of them together to make the pumpkin shape. Isn't that fun? The Crisp Air scrapbooking stamp, and you can get these with or without the thin cuts. And they are um, these f floral backgrounds uh, and they're, they're sort of distressed. I love it. Look how they use that paper pack um, on that scrapbook layout. I love it. The scrapbooking workshop for Crisp Air is absolutely gorgeous. Look at those layouts. Some really unique things there. You get everything you need to make three coordinating 12 by 12 two page layouts. It comes with instructions. You get the Crisp Air paper pack and sticker sheet, the cardstock you need, um, some exclusive pattern paper die cuts and the dots. This is the card making workshop for Crisp Air. Um, I have purchased this one. I haven't received it yet, but I got it mainly for that thin cut. Isn't that gorgeous? I really, really love it. Here you get all of the materials you need to create 16 cards for each of four designs. You get the pattern paper, two pattern paper sheets, six cardstock sheets, gold glitter gems, and then the cards and envelopes. This is the mix in paper pack for this catalog, and it will go with all three of the collections. You can also get the mix in coordinating cardstock where you get six sheets. The one thing I recommend is getting two packs of those because you only get one of each um, sheet. Okay, now let's get into some of the My Acrylic stamp sets. Look at the artwork on these pages. You can already tell that the stamp sets in this catalog are going to be amazing. The first one here is called On, on the Farm. You can get it with or without the thin cuts. It's got all of the farm animals you need. This is my favorite out of the whole catalog. Beep, boop, beep, beep, boop stamp set. <laughs> These robots. My nephew loves robots. So of course, this was the first thing on my list. Look at the artwork for the next page. That toad, that one's called Totally Awesome. And you can get it with or without the thin cuts that cuts out the frog and the um, cattails. Look at this artwork. Isn't that beautiful? What a cute page. And that goes with the Party Fox stamp set. You can get it with or without the thin cuts. So you've got the little foxes having a, a party with the party hats. I love how they background stamped the mushrooms on that layout. 
I think this one's going to be a fan favorite for my customers. It's called That's the Tea Stamp. You can get it with or without the thin cuts. You've got different teapots. You've got a little honey pot, teacups. Look at those cute cards that have been made using that set. Look at the one on the bottom right where they random stamped on the background using some of the stamp sets. And in this card, they use the crisp air, that um, specialty paper with the uh, watercolor dots on it. We also have some special M size stamps. Um, more people like you, about your age, sign seal delivered, and thoughts and prayers. And those are um, small. You can see the little um, sort of tags that they made using those. This one is called See You at the Finish Line. And this stamp set does not come with thin cuts. It is only the stamp set. You can make cute uh, racing layouts. And again, they use that crisp air paper with the dots. Here's another really cute one called At the Park. This is a one that also does not have thin cuts. It's mainly meant for scrapbooking layouts. This stamp set is a summer fun. It's called Moments That Matter. And you can get this stamp set with or without the thin cuts. I love that roller skate. How many of you used to go roller skating? I love to roller skate. And on this side, you have the Barbecue Boss stamp. You can get it with or without the thin cuts. So much fun. I love how they random stamped using that little hot dog uh, on the background and some candy apple ink. The little hamburger is so cute on that top right card. Licensed to grill. Isn't that cute? This is an absolute joy of a stamp set. It's called a Hoyler stamp set. And you can get it with or without the thin cuts. And this is called Writing in the Sand. I love, love, love the stamp set. This one does not come with a thin cut. This is one that I had to buy with my first order. I absolutely love it. And what I wanted to show you here is that these, um, the sand and the water come as two separate stamps. So you can stamp one in like a sand color and the other one in a more you know water color this one i did uh, embossing so that's white embossing with ink blended over it and then this one i direct stamped the stamps onto the paper with the different colored inks The stamp set on the top is called Adventure Badges. Find your wild, are, are we there yet? You will never know until you go. So cute. And then the set on the bottom is called Some More Adventures. Uh, it, that one is too cute for words. Look at that. I love that little bear that's roasting marshmallows over the fire. Too, too cute. Look at the bear and the fire and the little marshmallows. I needed that last year when we had our fire pit. Okay, the top stamp set here is called Autumn Vibes. You get 14 stamps. Some really cute pumpkins and apples. And then the one on the bottom is called Sunflower Thoughts. I love the size of those sunflowers. Nice and big. The artwork here is really gorgeous. Shows you how you can use the sunflowers. But also the pumpkins and the apples and things and the hay bale from uh, the Autumn Vibe set. Here's another set that I really love. I love the font on this one. This is called Language of Flowers. And I love the slimline card that they made. Um, they used the... I don't know what you would call it, bouquet of flowers twice, once up and once down. This stamp set, um, you can get it just the stamps or you can get it with the thin cuts. And it's really special. Each leaf stamp shown below has coordinating um, 
thin cuts. There's two different thin cuts. There's one to cut out the outline, and then there's one that cuts out the little veins on the leaves. So you can use it just to cut the veins or to cut veins to put on top of your stamped image. Um, on the top here, we have three different thin cut sets. One is a pumpkin, so it just cuts out the pumpkin. The second one is a maple leaf thin cut, cuts out the maple leaf. And then the third one is called gratitude. One says grateful and one says thankful. So you get an idea about the size of those um, based on those cards. And then um, the fourth one is the autumn foliage border and background stamps. So you get the one big border that you can see there um, that you can stamp an all over border. And then there's also uh, the all over background and then there's also the border stamps there. Okay, now we're getting into the stamp of the month. You get um, the July stamp of the month. It's called Voice of the Sea. And you've got the, the turtle and the angelfish and a crab and a seagull and some coral, a sea, uh, starfish. I'm going to show you about the size of those. Really nice size. I feel it's a nice size to make... Um, you know, use itself on a card. Here I've made a couple samples using some Distress Oxide ink blending and I just stamped it in black over top of it. Here I did one that I used uh, some coloring in and I made a tunnel card. And I fussy cut all of those pieces out. Okay, the August stamp of the month is special. Back to school time. It is called Teach, Love, and Inspire, and it is um, geared towards teachers um, to make all those thank you cards that you need to make for your teachers. There's a uh, many different icons here. You've got the globe, you've got a coffee cup, an alarm clock, books, a notebook. I made several um, cards here. I made this set with a, a one sheet wonder design. And if you are one of my VIPs, you will be getting the directions on how to make these cards. If you're interested in getting a uh, set of instructions for making cards each month for the um, stamp of the month, check out my website about how to become a VIP. And the last stamp of the month is for September. And it is called Enjoy These Moments. It's got a really beautiful floral, floral heart. I would say it's not really floral. I would say it's more leaves and pine cone heart and some nice sentiments. And then the last stamp set that we have all year long is our Smile Big stamp set. $7 of the proceeds goes to our charity Operation Smile. And there you have it, the Close to My Heart July, August, September catalog. It is so great, and it will last three months. If you'd like anything, go to my website at thecraftychemist.closetomyheart.com.